Hey guys, so I want to do a video. I want to do some sort of favorite videos, but since I do like a makeup favorite video uh, every week, I wasn't going to do like an October favorites, but I was going to do kind of a fall fashion favorites for October kind of thing. I'm not sure what I'll call it yet. You already know because, you know, you just already know. Um, so anyways, I'm just going to show you. I don't have like you know, a thousand, you know what I mean? Like, I don't have that many, so I just have, like, a couple, which are kind of transitioning for, like, winter as well. Like, winter and fall go hand in hand, as you all know, so I just have a few to share with you, and I think I'm going to do these monthly, since I do one, like, weekly uh, for beauty favorites, because I like to switch out my collection. Um, I think I'm going to do a fall, like a, not a fall, but a fashion favorite video like every month. So if you like that idea, let me know in the comments. Also, um, I don't know if anybody's interested, but I thought I would just bring it to your guys' attention. I've been working on like, uh, cause I'm, I'm working out now and I just like work out at home. Like it's just, I hate going to the gym. I don't know why but like I only like to go to a gym if I have someone to go with and I really don't have anybody to go with because they're at school so anyway I have oh, I so forth, but um I've just been planning a workout schedule for myself through a couple of apps and stuff like that so if you want to know my workout routine and what I do to work out and how I just um keep healthy let me know and I could do like a health video on that because uh, I have everything written down here in my Hello Kitty notebook which I just love so, so much um I just have like every thing written down as to what I'm going to start doing and all of that so I planned it this morning before I went to my cosmetology school interview which went amazing and uh, I'm going to do a separate video on that because I I just want to because I have so much to talk about I'm so excited but I can't tell you this video this is a, such a long intro so bear with me guys I'm so sorry um but let's go ahead and get into the fashion favorites um and one I have this I have this accessory that sounded weird oh and then also these these earrings are like my all-time favorite earrings so I'll just mention them in this video and we'll be done with that um but they're just these dangly uh chandelier earrings and I believe I got them at Kohl's a while ago um, and I wore them, they were for, like, homecoming, um, a few years, like, for my freshman year, so, like, four years ago, literally, so, anyway, this other, uh, accessory is my all-time, like, favorite for fall, for, like, all the time, but I really like wearing it in the fall time now, uh, I wore it all the time, like, when I first got it, because I got it in, like, for my birthday, I went out and bought it, and it was only, like, $18, um, uh, but I saw it at, like, Nordstrom's, and I was like, I have to have it, so it just says Dream in rose gold, and then this is, uh, like a, it's not leather, but it feels like leather, like, fake leather, um, and it's, like, a really light pink, and the details are all rose gold, and it just snaps, and there's two different sizes, so you can do, like, smaller or bigger, and I need the smaller size, so that's that, it's super cute, I love it. And it's by BCBG, but I'm pretty sure there's other, like, knockoff brands. Well, I mean, knockoff brands. I mean, I'm pretty sure that there's other brands that make them now because it's, like, a huge thing to have these little words on a bracelet. Um, it was then, and I still think it's in, so I really like that. Uh, they range from, like, 12 to $18 because they have little ones, and that was, like, a bigger one that was about, like, an inch. And then those are, like, a fourth of an inch. Like, they're really small. Moving on as this scarf, I don't want to like move the camera, it's a scarf, it's a navy blue striped scarf and kind of feels like a gauzy material and then on one end it says L in pink with the breast cancer ribbon, um, they were for Kohl's Cares uh, a while ago, I think they did it again this year but I don't know, they probably had different things, it's just a really nice long scarf and I love scarves, like I used to hate wearing scarves because they just like were awful for me, I don't know why, maybe it's just because I've lost weight because I don't know why but I think it's because I lost weight but I just love the scarf, it's nice and wide, it's nice small stripes are not too big and I really really like it to just spice up your outfit uh, if you're just wearing a you know blank shirt plain shirt you know this will really spice up your outfit so I love doing that as always it's kind of like a statement piece so that one's super cute and those were like five dollars so if they did it again they're probably still on the website and on Cold's website and they probably are on sale now so they'll be even cheaper than five dollars um 
Another favorite is this purse, and I don't know if I've said that in my Sassy Saturday, so I'm really sorry if I have. Um, and I'll find out the brand, because I know it's somewhere in here, like, you know, wait, I might find it. It's by, let me see, Rampage. So it's not really like a brand or anything, but it's really good quality. I've had this purse for a really long time, and I believe it costs like 30 bucks or something, but it was completely worth it. Um, well, it's not like that's expensive, but it was at TJ Maxx, and I believe it was $80, but I just love the eggplant color. Um, and why did I put this on my shoulder? <laughs> Um, and I just love that it has a long strap and that there's gold details and especially this gold detail. And again, like I said, it's an eggplant color and you can see there's like a little bit of teal peeking through there. It just reminded me of Peacock when I got it and I love Peacocks. Still loving Peacocks and it's a great fall purse for me. It's really big. There's like four, like, areas in here in this purse so it's really nice and big and if you're going out shopping all day it's perfect because it has the cross body bag um thing and all of that and if you fill it up it sits up so that's a plus as well it's not super structured though so you know um another fave are these slippers and i know this is so random to talk about but um if anybody buys like the slippers that you get it like just like the really inexpensive slippers that you just slide on, there's no like back behind your heel or anything, and like you are walking on your floor and they just start turning like sideways. I hate those slippers because I always liked them when I was little and I'm like, oh my gosh, that's so cute because they would have like the cute little kid pair and you know, like a rainbow and whatever. And every time I'd freaking wear them, they would, like, go on their side, and I'd be, like, sliding around, and I'm just like, what's happening? So they were awful, and they were uncomfortable, so I found these pair last year, but they're selling them again. Um, so, well, let me show you. They're selling these guys again, and I love the way that they look. They have them in different colors. My mom has them in beige. I have them in red, obviously, and then I think the beige is, like, this color, like, of the darker part of the fur. Um, and I think there was another color, like black or something maybe, or gray. I'm not 100% sure what the other color was, but there were three colors. And this is what they look like. They're by Vera Wang, the Simply Vera Wang line at Kohl's. And they're just really nice because it, com it comes back and, like, covers your heel enough. And it's got, like, a really nice, like, hard sole. Uh, and they're just really cute. And I love them. And they just remind me of Christmassy. And I like to wear them in the fall if my feet get cold. Um, I used to not be like a huge slipper person anyway because I just didn't like my anything to be on my feet because like my feet would get hot, which is so weird. Um, but I just love like the, they're, they're lined with fur and then it's a super cute red print and then the little jewels on the side here are super cute as well. So I freaking love the, these slippers a lot. So if you're looking for some slippers and you have the problem with the like slipper problem that I had, uh then try these guys out and I think they were like 10 15 bucks I can't remember um but do you guys have like the problem with that with slippers or have you seen other people have problems with them like am I the only one I have no idea and then my other favorite I'm wearing well I have another favorite after that but I'm wearing one of my favorites and I showed you guys before but I'm gonna pull it up over my face it's the sweater with this really pretty jeweled um part so you don't have to wear like a statement necklace and it's just a um basic like pullover sweater type thing and it kind of feels like hoodie material but it's not hoodie material it's like way softer than hoodie material but did you know what I mean like a pullover that's basically what it is it's so casual like that and then the back has a really pretty like flowy part um let me see if I can show you so it's just got this really flowy material on it as you can see and it's kind of it's kind of like a high-low, so, uh, but it's not too high-low. Well, I guess it does cover my butt. I didn't realize that before. And I don't really like high-lows, but this one isn't super high-low. I don't know if it's because my boobs make it, like, shorter on the top, and it really shouldn't be. I don't really know, but it looks fine. Uh, and my last fashion favorite, I'll just show you one, are these high um, thigh high boots, I guess. Well, they're not thigh high. They're like knee high boots. Um, they go right underneath of my knee and they are a dark gray gunmetal weed color and they're fake leather, uh, obviously, you know, but they're really easy to clean off 
and I love the detailing on the foot here. Like, I just like the detailing. It's really hard to, like, show the detailing, but I just really like the way that it looks. Um, and, yeah. And they're super wide. I don't know why they're so wide. Well, I do know why they're so wide, because I need, like, wider calves when I was heavier. Uh, so I don't really need that anymore, but it's fine now because, um, it's not skin tight. Like, it, there's room. Like, you can shove whatever the heck you want in my boot, and, yeah. But... I like that style better than when it was skin tight onto my cap, but that's the way I had to wear them. And then I like that the they're all laced up and all of that, so I really, really like these. I got these on a website called Torrid, uh, and um, I have worn these a ton. I wore these to, like, every single football game when it was cold. Uh, some of the football games I did were my black flip-flops from Old Navy, which are my all-time favorite black flip-flops. They're not, like, the uh, foam ones. They were, like, spongy, like... I don't know what kind of material they were. They were not, like, the sponge one, though. Um, like, the hard sponge, like they normally sell. Uh, but yeah. Anyways, um, that was it for my fashion favorites. If you like these videos, let me know and give them a thumbs up. And if you want me to do these monthly, just let me know in the comments or if you think that's a good idea. Uh, you know, however you want to tell me. And I should be having the video for my cosmetology, uh, up soon after this video. I know I have a few videos before this one to upload and I'm trying to film a bunch um, in advance if I'm thinking of stuff to film. But anyways, uh, that's pretty much it. I'll talk to you guys later. Hope you have a great day. Bye guys!